going on gamers? This is Jimmy Bailey from Jimmy Bailey TV bringing you part two of my episode two of Wolf Among Us playthrough. Um, if you've watched my first part of this playthrough, you know that I'm giving away a season pass for this uh, for this game. It's a really good game. Hope you guys like it. It's by Telltale. Um, so yeah, if you want to win, just make sure you subscribe to both channels, my YouTube and my Twitch, and make sure that you uh, like the video and you comment, you st just saying, you know, some cheesy thing, Wh who's your favorite character, what you like about it, whatever you want. Also, if you watch my first video, you know about my giveaways. I do an epic giveaway every month where I give away something big. Last, uh, I just gave away last week, Pulse Headset. That was on the 31st of January. Um, 31st of December, I gave away Bioshock Infinite, Ultimate Songbird Edition with the statue and everything. Um, next month, I'm giving away, or I'm sorry, this month, I'm giving away Titanfall Xbox One controller. Alright guys, let's get right into it, huh? This whole thing is complete bullshit, and always has been. Oh, I mean, Rebecca what's his the job, truck. really? To keep shit from reaching the woodlands. We ripped Jack, that guy's arm off in the first episode. You're a bar. You're supposed to have darts around. And I normally do, but who knows where the fuck they went to after... Oh, after me? Come on, Holly. I need entertainment. <laughs> This'll do. Yeah. Let's just put everything away. <laughs> okay, okay, I know. Just relax. Not here to start anything. Okay. Miss White. Drink eat. Fight I heard the you had kind of a strange morning. It's been kind of a strange morning for everyone, I think. Every time I see this guy, he seems to lose weight. It's amazing. It really is. He loses weight and yet somehow keeps all the muscle. Jack. Wolfie, my dear, how are you? Because, you know, we were just talking about you. All of us. I'm really not in the mood right now. Well, I was in the mood to play darts, so I guess nobody's getting Ooh. what they want. I'm dying to hear about the body that came out of the East River this morning. It was a fable, right? Oh, everyone knows. Tweedledee was just No, was that? How'd he get out? He said it looked like Snow White. Sure it wasn't Tweedledum? Well, no, but he seemed uh, pretty sure. Crane. Sorry. You let him out? Tweedledee said you arrested him for no earthly reason. Kept him locked in the cellar all fucking night. <laughs> he said you tortured him. You just stop talking. Which, I don't know, that seems like a breach of your legislative duties. Bigby, come on. You can't be so dumb as Jack, to... find the off button, now. What is it with you two? You and Gran are all, let's get a posse Ooh. together when there's no one around. Really? But as soon as the big bad wolf walks in, your tails go between your legs. He fucking maimed you. Aren't you pissed? Cat got your nerve. <laughs> what happened? What happened? I'm tired is what happened. Tired of what? Jack. What? Bigby, look. Two fables are dead. And shit, Gren's sister... Holly's sister. Holly's sister has been missing for what? A few days now? And we haven't heard word one about it from anyone. Actually, have there been any updates? Oh, no. I don't know how to say this to you, Holly. The woman we found in the river. Who was it? You know who oh. it was. That sucks. Boy, I sure walked into that one. If you say one yeah. more fucking thing, shut up, just huh? one more thing. Yeah, we'll take a walk, bud. God fucking damn it! Of course, the dear princess Snow fucking White is all oh, safe shut and up. sound. Where were you when we reported this weeks ago, huh? Where are you when we ever fucking need you? You'd give one ounce of a shit about her, about any of us. She might have been saved. She might have been cared for. She might have been. Ooh.
All right, everyone. Clear out. I ain't leaving her with you. No way. <clears throat> Poor girl, man. Holly. Get the fuck out of my the answer to to me. Where'd the New York accent come from? I just want to oh, Boston accent. Okay. It should have been you, and it wasn't. What does snow ever do to you, man? We recovered this from her personal effects. I thought you might like to have it. I... I didn't know she still had this. Oh, the copper was from a dwarf mine. It's very rare and very old. It's quite lovely. Grin. Yeah. Take off Take for a, a bit, would you? Are you sure? Yeah, we're not gonna kill her, bro. Nice boots. <laughs> I don't know that much about her life. Honestly, we didn't talk often. <sighs> she was lost here in the city. She just got swept away by it. It seems so fucking petty now, but I just, I didn't want to watch it with her. I think she was off the Monday drugs, but she was hooking Aww. to pay down debt. It ain't me up to see her that way. Eventually, the only people she owed were at her work. You know, that shithole club, the pudding and <laughs> pie. Name of a club, huh? Pudding and pie. The owner, Georgie, with all his fucking fees. It's a crock of shit. That's how they kept her under their thumb, really. Holly, it's okay. If it's too much, we don't have to do this. Pudding and pie, huh? What do you know about the place? It's a real garbage dump. We can just go check it out. We've got a lead. Maybe we can take it from here? <sighs> really? Thanks for everything, Holly. Is there, um, is there anything we can do to... No, no, I'm it's better tough off with things alone. I don't need sympathy and I don't need charity. It's not charity. It's looking out for our own. Aww. Is she? Where is she? She's at the business she office. She doesn't head. She's taken care of. I'm gonna have to go down there and get her. Fuck. Please, we can handle the funeral arrangements. No, no. It's it's a kind of... It, it's a formality with trolls. We burn our dead by sunrise or... I don't know. Of course. Okay. <clears throat> Good. Let's go down to the business office and start making the necessary preparations. Uh oh. Right? I promised the body. Why did it say that? Am I not supposed to give it to her? I hope that doesn't bite me in the ass later. That club? I'll go down there now. See what I can find out from the owner. You were good with her. Thanks. Really? Thanks. It just made everything easier. All right, let's get to good stuff. Get some action, huh? Let's see if my capture kit messes up again. I've been having uh, technical difficulties. Every time I play a Telltale game and it switches scenes, it freaks out. I gotta reset the uh, capture kit, which is dumb. Must be the way they, you know, record or... I don't know. I don't know. All I know is it sucks. Game's good so far. I like the story. Everything freezes on a Telltale game, man. 
Yep, see that? There it goes. Alright. Let me just put this capture kit back up for you guys. It does that every time I switch a scene. I don't know why. Which switches chapters, whatever you want to call it. The pudding and pie. Well, that's why she had the New York accent. She was in New York. I didn't even remember that. Totally forgot they were in New York. Nobody else has the accent. Oh. Oh, Shira, Shira. What a nice surprise. I'm not sure I've seen you here before. Yeah, you want it. <laughs> You're always welcome, of course. Is it business or pleasure? Well. Or both? I'm looking for someone. Finding you someone is our specialty, but the club's closed. Not quite what I meant. That's too bad. Huh. I guess you'd better talk to Georgie. You're in luck. He's here. Come on. Uh -oh, we're going to the booby club. I should warn you that Georgie does not like to be bothered when he's working. And he's in kind of a mood right now. I mean, more so than mm. usual. It'll be fine. I have a way with people. <laughs> so <laughs> I've heard. Nice bow. Alright. <clears throat> Let's go see Georgie. <clears throat> Welcome to the Pudding and Pie, where we cater to the diverse tastes of the Fable community. Your pleasure is our pleasure. Your desires are our desires. Did you know Lily? She worked here? Oh, my lips are sealed. You'd better ask Georgie. Oh. <laughs> Old school. Oh, there's some boobs. Fuck's sake. What do you think you're doing? You look like you're trying to take a shit. Who's going to want that? No one's going to want that. I can take it from here. Good luck. It's your face. You have to smile. You never smile. How many times do I have to say it? You're supposed... Hmm. Oh, it's you. We're nice closed. hat. Loser. Keep dancing, you. I didn't say stop. Wow. For fuck's sake. I'm trying to think in my head. Am I allowed to put you this on YouTube? Stay or right not? there. <laughs> Don't even think about sitting down. We're not finished. Leave her alone, asshole. Sure, whatever you say. What do you want then? You here for a little taste? I don't mind. Tell you what, <laughs> come back after midnight, maybe. I can hook you up. Okay, hook you up. Knowing you, she's probably not quite your style. You'd prefer someone who can take mm -hmm. a bit of a beating. Tell me, do you prefer a stationary target or one that will put up a fight? I can arrange whatever you like for the <laughs> right price. I'm not here for that. Oh, I'm not here for that. <laughs> you just stopped in for the chips then. Jesus, Big B, you're so corny. I love it <laughs> though. No, seriously, I love it. Okay, all right, Sheriff. Just fucking with you. It's afraid of me, huh? I know why you're here. Who told you? Listen, Sheriff. Around here, we can't afford to wait for you and your swanky pals to take an interest. We have to look out for each other. When shit happens, I hear about it. Especially if it concerns my livelihood. In that case, I assume you knew Lily was glamour. Of course he was, you duff You duff it. She was a troll. No. I mean glamour to look like another fable. Yeah? Well, so what? 
Who gives a toss? People get up to all kinds of things when nobody's watching. It's their own business. It's sick. Ha! <laughs> That's quaint. Especially coming from you. The 13th floor would never provide a glamour like that. It's strictly black market stuff. Ooh, black market, is it? How exciting. Mm. This is exactly what I would expect from a thug like you. Storm in, throw around a bunch of accusations, try to scare people. But you've got fuck all <laughs> to back it up. And we're all just meant to jump any time the wolf shows his teeth. He used to be something, you know. Get that out of my face. This was part of the glamour we found on Lily's body. Take a good look. She was impersonating Snow White. Why? You've got this all wrong. If Lily was doing a special glamour, it wasn't for me. For fuck's sake, I want that kind of eat. Who was she doing it for, then? She had clients, Bigby. Maybe one of them was into it. A lot of fucked up people in Fable Town. Like who? Try looking in the mirror. Oh, beast. Anyway, now what to do with me? Go on, then. She looks scary. Ooh. You're gonna hit me. Go ahead. That's what you want to do, right? That's what you came here for, right? One more time. Who hired her? <laughs> oh, no. Fuck. <coughs> you! Take your sad fucking face where I can't Ooh. see it. Bloody bastard fucking shit. You proud of yourself, mate? Proud of your little mess? Fuck's sake. <laughs> Hold on a minute. Hans, is it? No, great. Here I go. Hans just cleans up and provides a little muscle when we need it. He's not going to know anything about the girls and their clients or any of that. No one knows. Don't you get it? It's by design. Discretion is our guarantee, right? And the way we guarantee that is that no one knows anything they don't have to know, including me. I cover my eyes and take my coat. End of story. Why not look it up? What's that? Isn't there a little book with all the stuff about the <laughs> girls and all that written in You're it? You're a fucking <laughs> moron. Show me. There is no book. And as for you, Hans, we need to work on your communication Ooh. skills and have a fairly good idea where to start. Hey, that's my personal property. <laughs> Sure, go ahead. Do what comes naturally. <laughs> Tell me about the book. You haven't got the slightest clue about anything. Hey, now. Try not to be a bully. Cut the crap, Georgie. I want the book Hans is talking about. Hans is confused. Again. Alright, we're breaking the next thing. Don't even think about it. <laughs> Jesus, fuck! Do not touch that. You hear me? That's nothing to do with you. There's still time for you to just cough it up. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but there's no Andy Magic book with everything you want to know jotted down inside. I sincerely wish there was. Maybe it would get you off oh, my back. Oh, where's underneath the keg? Well, well, what's this? Looks like a floor safe. Uh, I wouldn't know. It was here when we moved in. I don't have a key. Oh, to... really? Sheriff, will he come on? Fuck's sake, I've got to open up in a few hours. Give it to me. You're a big bad bastard. We get it. Everyone's <laughs> guilty. We fucking get it. Give me the key before I gotta kick your ass. Jesus. You're killing me. I'm begging you. I'll pay you. I don't have to hit you. Two women are dead. Then quit being a bloody idiot. Come on, mate. 
it. Leave it. There's nothing there for you. I don't want to destroy his stuff. I know. Everyone's gonna get mad. They want me to destroy back. it all, but. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> I don't want to be the guy they all think I am. Man. It's cool that it makes you, lets you decide whether you want to break shit or not. Bloody come on, man. Prick. Once again, don't get your hopes up. There's nothing in here that'll tell you anything. But it's a kick to the balls for me and my club, so we can be happy about that. Here, this is Lily's last entry. So tell me, Georgie, who's this Mr. Hmm. Smith? Oh dear. I'm afraid it might be a fake name, <laughs> Big Ben. Secrecy is sort of how this all works. Even Hans knows that. What's 207? Room number? I don't fucking know. Millimeters, ah. maybe? Don't bullshit me, Georgie. This is your book. Your girl. not their fucking secretary. I give them a stage. I give them music. I provide an erotic venue to attract and retain clients. But let's be clear on something. The Ooh. girls make the arrangements with their clients, not me. The girls. They're the ones with the Mr. Smiths and Joneses and Mr. X types. Whatever happens outside the club, that's on them. I log the business, take my cut, and I'm out. Now, I've had quite enough of you and your bullying. Excuse me while I call your superiors to make a <laughs> complaint. Hello. Hello. Business office. Business office. Yeah, that's right. See, good thing I was nice to her. And now I get to uh, get information from her. Oh, secretary. Wow, both of them are dead. Lock's been busted open. Broken open, but there isn't even a lock. Faith, thanks for hmm. covering for me tonight. Let's talk before you go over to the apartment. Ooh. Lily. Looks like they both saw one of Lily's clients. <laughs> I'm thinking it's Beast. Gloss, compact, glitter. Because we haven't seen Beast all up, all at all in this episode. Faith. Although we still have three episodes left, I don't think we're gonna find out who it is yet. Looks like this is gonna be a long episode, huh? Alright, I guess there's nothing down there. Excuse me. Hmm, she's dressed. I heard you out there. I don't remember ever seeing you here before. You're trying to place <laughs> me. They used to call me the little mermaid. Oh, really? Once upon a time. Does that help? What are you doing here? Same as anyone. It's a place where I am. Where else am I supposed to be? In my arms. My name is Nerissa. <laughs> well, Nerissa, I've got some questions. Of course you do. I don't have oh, answers. Really? You'll have to find those yourself. I need to know about one of Lily's uh, 
clients, calling himself Mr. Smith, apparently. We can't talk about work. This is a murder case. I mean, can't. These lips are sealed. They keep saying that, guarantee. Man. It's how things work here. People keep using those phrases. What does it mean? This is what I need to know about. Lily's last entry. Who's Mr. Smith? Where's room 207? I have to know. These lips. Aww. Sheriff Wolf, would you like to make an appointment with me? Okay. She wants to talk. What would I need to do? I need 150. It's not good to be short. Okay. Oh, I, uh, I don't, uh... Wait here for a second. Oh, she's putting the money up for me. She wants to help. Not two oh seven. You'll think hmm. of something. The open arms. Hmm. This is where they met. Enjoy your stay. I hope you find what you're looking for. Thanks for your help, darling. Cop getting his dick well, I mean, sorry, forgot I tried keeping a PG-13 on my, my, uh, my videos. Cop getting a hooker, nothing new, huh? Wow, this is a nice looking place. They should probably <laughs> repair that. If the rooms are anything like the lobby, they should cut their rates. <laughs> People don't usually come for the rooms here. Want it by the hour or for the whole night? Ooh. Oh, beauty. Uh, beauty. I work here, okay? I work the front desk. It's to help pay rent. So now you know. I know I should have told somebody, but Beast would lose his mind if you knew. Beast is a proud man, Bigby. He wants to do right by me, and he. He just couldn't handle it if he knew I had to do this so we don't get evicted. Well, your secret's safe with me, all right? Let's not make a big thing of it. Thanks, Bigby. And thanks for covering for me last time, too. So, what just are you doing up. here? Okay. Oh, you have a key. 
Someone else was murdered last night. I heard. The victim was someone who worked at the Pudding and Pie, Lily. She, uh, come around here ever? Oh, oh, yes, the, the troll. I did see her. I mean, you know, we never really spoke, but she came off a tad oh. intimidating. Have you seen Snow White down here? Or maybe somebody glamoured as her? You know, it's funny. I did see someone who I thought looked a lot like her, but she didn't say anything when she saw me, even though she knew that I saw her. I just assumed it wasn't Snow and went about my business. I talked to oh, Tweedledee earlier today. Him. He mentioned you in passing. Do you know him or his brother? I took out a loan for back pay. It was like our third notice. And ever since then, those annoying freaks have been pestering me for the money plus interest. Why take out a loan from those two? It was from the crooked man. Beauty. <laughs> you don't know how desperate I was, Bigby. I had nowhere else to go. Look. If this ever happens again, come see me or <laughs> Snow first, all right? I tried. Ooh. Ever see Lily with someone here? Maybe on a job? Sometimes, but nobody I've recognized. I haven't worked here that long, though. How about a room register? Or someone named Mr. Hmm. Smith. Wow, those. <laughs> That's all we get here. Smiths, Jones, or Johnsons. I think the last ones are jokes. Ever meet a girl named Faith? Or just maybe hear that name? I might have. I don't know. By the end of the night, it's it's kind of a blur with all the names. Tara, Brandy, Amber, <laughs> Heather. Sorry. Who's... He just puts a cigarette out anywhere. It'll be better if anyone sees you, that they at least see you with me, so they know that I didn't let you just wander around by yourself. Five minutes, please. We'll see. Beauty. <laughs> just be ready to act like I'm trying to kick you out. That won't be hard. Well, Beauty's working at a at a slut house, at a whore house. Listen, Bigby, I assume you'll be filing some kind of an official report or something, which is fine. It's just that I was wondering if I need to be in it. Do you have to mention my name? I mean, it's it's not like Beast would ever see your report. It's just, well, you never know. Don't worry about it. The less I have to write down, the better. <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate it. You're gonna have to pay me back for all Here these covers, are. man. Oh, Which yeah. one was it? It's 207. Uh, oh, I do want to hear the doors, though. <laughs> Whoa! Let's just go to a seven gun. Anybody in there? You have keys to these rooms? I thought you had a key. Not to this one. 
Hold on, Bigby. <laughs> I can't just let you go into any room you want. Seriously, what if someone found out? I could get into a lot of trouble. You have to let me in there. This is the room, 207. But I... This is the room Lily was in. <sighs> Fine. Damn right, all those favors I did for you. Oh. That's weird. This key is supposed to open every room in the building, but it's not working. Beauty! Ah, oh, shit. Beast? Oh, no! Oh. How could you do this, this to me? No. No. no! no! Wait a minute! How could you do this? We've been together through everything! I took care of you! I love- not what you think! Please! No, no we You're gotta fight You're cheating him. on me! With him?! No, no, Beast! I promise I'm not! I'm helping him, that's all! I'll bet! I'm sure you help each other just great! I know what this place is! Relax, Beast. It's not what you think. Stop lying to me! What the fuck is wrong with you? She's my wife! Beast, listen to me! Don't There's nothing touch going her. on! I'm not! Ah! Hey! Faster! I guess I finally see you for who you are! Stop! Stop it! Is this you staying out of it? I thought I could trust you! Listen to your wife! Just calm down and. Beast! Here we go. Ah! <laughs> Tap it, 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 See, I, I keep trying to be nice. I need to just beat their asses. You ruined everything! She's my fucking. Well, now I got into the room I need it. You, you don't want to see hand. this. She had those in her hand. Shit. What is it? Oh, oh my god. Don't touch anything. Is this... is this... Lily met her client here. Mr. Smith, whoever he is. And then... It must have happened right here. Jesus. Last night? Yeah? I was on ship hmm. last night. On shift? Beauty, what? I'm not a prostitute, you idiot. I work the front desk. I... so that's... Yeah. Still, this is no place for someone like you. I mean, look. Do you remember who rented this room last night? I don't think anyone did. Not last night. Maybe they have it long term. I don't know. How am I supposed to know? I'm done. It just seemed like a totally normal night. How is that even possible? There's hmm. so much blood. Yeah, there is. Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But Just do what he says. I'll explain later, okay? Bigby, what kind of a person could do something like this? 
That's exactly what I'm about to try to find out. I can't believe this. Do all the rooms have these same clocks with the built-in cassette I don't think we player? met the killer yet. I think so, yes. There's no one that I've met really does. It. I don't think I, I don't, I can't see him, anybody we've met so far doing that. It's like she was lying down when she was killed. Flowers were already here. How do you know that? Blood pattern. Also, I'd say the body was dragged off the foot of the bed. There. The body. Mm. Jesus. You could say she. Poor girl. I just can't even imagine. What are you still doing watching? We shouldn't even be in here. It's a huff and puff. I thought you were the only one who smoked that crap brand. Apparently not. He brought mm. wine. Uh -huh. Lassie. <sighs> what is that? It's a book about Snow White. Or about the Mundy version of her story, anyway. It's not in English. The whole book is about her? Yeah. Why is she in a glass coffin? This is the part where she's in a deep sleep, but they think she's dead. You don't know the story? Hmm. What's it mean? Why mark the page where she's sleeping? I think he made up the bed to match the coffin in the picture. Flowers, too. He'd have had Lily lie down just like this. You mean just before? In the story, that's when someone comes to kiss Why'd her. Why'd he cut the hat off? That's our Mr. Smith. This is creepy. The coffin and, and the weird fixation on snow. What the hell is wrong with this guy? I was a creeper. For my arrival. <sighs> Someone's been rough with this dress. It's torn. Oh no. She must have been wearing it. He killed her and then and then he took it back off. No, there's no blood on it. It must have been torn some uh -huh. other time. What? What are you thinking? We found Lily wearing something else, tailored after one of Snow's suits. It's possible that the dress is actually for Mr. Smith himself. Okay, I wasn't <laughs> expecting that. But I guess a Snow White fixation could go that way too. Jesus, that poor girl. What did she walk into? She Our murder? No. <laughs> She probably just needed the money. She could have been oh, anyone. She's thinking of herself. How did she wind up here? I mean, not exactly here, but just how does a person? Georgie took advantage of her when she was in trouble. He's a real predator. Yeah. All right, let's put that tape. She must have been so scared. Oh, this is longer than I thought, man. All these episodes are pretty long. Some classical music. Bigby, this? I think I heard this music last night. It was playing pretty loudly for a while and then stopped huh. in the middle. I didn't think twice about it at the time. I, I mean, you hear all kinds of things around here and I guess I've already gotten used huh. to blocking them out. Could have covered up the sound of the murder. Maybe she didn't see it coming. If 
I see everything? Damn it. Get it together, beauty. Be strong. I think we've done everything. Anything else you can tell me about last night? Anything that sticks out in your mind? Sorry, no, it just seemed like every other night does. That's exactly what's bothering me. From now on, I'll just be down there imagining uh -huh. this. How can I find out who rented this room? Find whoever has the key? I'm pretty sure this one must be held long term. And we don't keep a register or anything. This place is intentionally kind of anonymous. Well, I'm pretty sure the guy's I not coming back. That. God. No. I think I found everything that I need to find. I don't want to be mean to her. Yeah, she's the only one that I can say stuff to. I'd better not find out you're hiding something from me about all this. What the hell is wrong with you? I'm not involved in this! Please, just do whatever you need to do and let's get out of here. Well, I guess I didn't have to say that. What am I missing? You guys are probably yelling at me like you guys see it. Well, let me click anything. Hmm. Huh. The only thing that's highlighted is this damn cassette player. I don't let me do anything to it. And I came and talked to her. Now I'm getting irritated. <laughs> oh my god. There's something. Where? There's no apple. How was I supposed to see that? No. Just apple. Huh. Oh no, there's more? What? What now? It's got a single bite taken out of it, like in Snow Story. Oh no, do you think it was poisoned? It wasn't. I'd have smelled that. I think it's just a prop. It's here because they were acting out the scene in the book. Of course. That makes perfect sense. He's just acting out another part of the book. God, Why'd he I call off her just head? Just trouble processing all of this. This guy has some kind of weird snow obsession, but then there's this other stuff too. I mean, he's wearing that dress. I'm just not sure what to do with that. I hope you're just about through. I don't really want to stay in here any longer. I don't think he's really wearing that dress.
Uh oh. Are those pictures of the dead girl? Pictures of snow. Who's watching me through the mirror? How do you know? I'm in this one. It was taken last winter. Oh no. Big B. This kind of stalking, it doesn't just stop by itself. Trust me, I know about this firsthand. He'll keep trying to get closer and closer. His stand-in for Snow is gone now, so... The dun, next dun, dun. step closer. Where's Snow? What is it? It's <gasps> Crane. No, now he knows. But Crane loves Snow. That doesn't make sense. I don't think Crane's the killer. He can't be. There's no way. Alright guys, I think that's the end. Tune in. I'll be doing a playthrough of uh, Outlast next. Make sure you subscribe, like the video, and comment to win it. Let's see what's... He could be after you now. Good. I am dying to get my hands on that disgusting Damn. weasel. Capture kit. Alright, guys. We're going to leave it there. I will, um... I'll be doing my giveaways like usual. Every Sunday, give away 20 bucks. PSN, Steam, Xbox, like usual, same exact thing. Epic giveaway this month is uh, Titanfall Xbox One controller. If you have any better ideas that you think a lot more people would like, please leave suggestions in the comments below. All right, I'm not, I don't have my heart set on the Xbox One controller, but a lot of people requested it. So, all right, guys, make sure you tune in. I'll be playing Outlast uh, later today, and I'll be playing a couple other things. I'll be playing Thief later this month. If it comes out on PS4, Xbox One, or PS3, um, I'll be playing it. Alright guys, talk to you later. And keep an eye out for any videos I have coming up. Peace.